City police rule a death of a one-year-old baby girl a homicide. The child died earlier this month, but the medical examiner's office just released the autopsy results a few hours ago. WJZ is live at City Police Headquarters. Ava Joy Burnett joins us with what we're learning. Ava Joy. Hi, Nikki. Well, the medical examiner's office said that baby's body had multiple signs of trauma. Tonight, Baltimore City Police are not saying anything on if they have a suspect. The city police are now saying a one year old baby is one of Baltimore's latest homicide victims. Really heartbroken because I got a lot of grandchildren. Where was it? And a lot of great grandchildren. Two weeks ago on October 4th, police say they were called to Ellicott Drive near Ashburton Street in West Baltimore because the baby was unresponsive. The department said officers tried to save her, but medics eventually determined that the child was dead. Her name was Naimia Gillard. In a one year old, come on now, what, what can a one year old do to you? The child is starting to walk. The baby's body was taken to the medical examiner's office, and Tuesday, doctors ruled her death a homicide because multiple signs of trauma. Tonight, Baltimore City Police are not saying who the baby was with or if they have any suspects because the case is still active and detectives are still investigating. People who live on this block are wondering how this could have happened. I felt sad as soon as I heard it on the news. Trust me, what can a one year old do to somebody for them to do whatever they did to this child? Once again, we asked Baltimore City Police specifically if they have any suspects. The department said they're not saying anything right now as they continue to investigate. Live at 5, Avajoy Burnett for WJZ.